Well, hello everybody, Looney Farm Guy here with a update test for Tuesday, May the 17th. And this is um, an update to the tool height control for headers by DD Mod Passion. Now this uh, this is a game changing uh, mod uh, that came out uh, not too long ago, and it's had a couple of updates. But this one is again extremely significant. Um, oh, oh yes, 0. 0.2 megabytes to download. <laughs> it's just you just can't, you just got to get this one. <clears throat> um, what they have added, what uh, the modder DD Mod Passion has added is uh, added tool height control for corn headers and tool height control for forage harvester headers. Now we have just a small sampling of all of them. So basically what this does is it takes the base game corn headers, all of these, all of the base game corn headers, and adds, as you can see here, tool height control to each. So it duplicates them and it puts them in your... Uh, the store menu here, not these, but this one. This is the biggest one, and adds that to them. Now, what he uh, that so <clears throat> originally the first one was the uh, harvester headers. As you can see here, we have tool height control. Uh, no, not those, not those. Tool height control. Here we go. <clears throat> so it gave us all the base game headers for for um, harvesters. Now we have corn headers. And forage harvester headers. So here's all the base game ones here. Now it has added, uh, let's go, 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 tool height control. <clears throat> We're going to talk about the Laco Tech in a moment, uh, but the tool con height control for the uh, poplar header, the pickups, the mowers, and the forage harvesters. Now this is extremely significant because we now have a mower head that will fit onto a har forage harvester, <clears throat> or you can use a Lacotec and a tractor to go as fast as you possibly can, as far as fast as that machine will push it, as well as the pickups and the forage harvester headers. Now I have uh, I have a few examples, as many as I could. Do without making this video an hour-long video. Um, they work just like uh, the base game ones, except um, they will go fast, and you can manually adjust the uh, header height in increments. Now we'll just get into this uh, uh, forage harvester real quick here, and I will show you on a. Uh, forage harvester header now this uh, any modded uh, harvester headers that you have downloaded uh, this will not work on because this is a specific mod unless uh, and I haven't seen um, them do any any modders do this to a specific mod yet now unfolding it you need to unfold it first this is a small one but now once that is done, uh, you will have the option R1 and the right stick up and down to manually adjust the height, however high or low you want. Once you turn it uh, on fold, so once you turn it on, oh, sorry, once you turn it on, you can still adjust the height, but now, with it on, you can go as fast as uh, your machine will push you whilst it's on. Now, okay, so, uh, first item is the corn uh, corn header. Here we have the uh, John Deere with the corn header. Uh, as you can see, R1, right stick, adjust that height, so for whatever you want. Sometimes they, they're too low when you... Uh, See, this one at the very bottom one, it's kind of dragging on the ground, so you can actually pick it up a little bit. See that? So now it's going to be moving a little freer, too. And if you have those areas where 
the ground's a little bumpy, you can lift it up a little bit, get around some bumps, anyways. But the most significant part of this is you can harvest corn at a blistering 26 miles per hour, which is the top speed of this harvester. Now, of course, if your harvester only goes 20 miles an hour, that is as fast as you'll be able to go. So, that is, uh, is awesome that we have that now. Now, the next thing we have is, what I'll show you, is uh, the uh, uh, harvester, uh, forage harvester on, on a forage harvester header header for a harvester Ugh. uh here again you can see that this is a tool height control one you can adjust it up and down let's turn it on and as we go forward we've already surpassed the six miles per hour that uh, it is typically rated for and we are making chaff at 25 miles per hour <laughs> and guess what the worker will do it too at that speed <laughs> oh, let's get in there and stop him before he... Um, but, yeah, they will... Uh, they will, um, yeah, do that. Now, uh, next one. The pickup, the grass pickup. Again, uh, R1, you can adjust the height on there, like so. Turn it on. Moving forward, you can now pick up grass as fast as you can go. <laughs> All right, so what next? But why, why pick up grass when you can mow grass? <laughs> at 26 miles per hour with the grass mower header on there and mow it and pick it up all in one fell swoop like so right <laughs> oh dear I don't remember this uh, being for mowers on farm sim 19 I know we had this mod but the uh, I didn't I didn't remember having the mower header as part of the adjustable tool height control but now we have it and it is simply awesome uh, now one more thing left is oh yes so um, word of caution uh, see the Lanco Tech uh, right here, uh, the base game one. Uh, it has now also, uh, this mod has also made a version of it here. However, uh, there is a problem with this tool height control for, uh, for headers modded LH2. I will explain that in a moment. I have the base game LH, Lanco Tech. And uh, what you do is you lower, uh, no, you highlight this, you lower the unit, and then you can uh, raise and lower the uh, mower on there. I would suggest having it right up. Uh, turn it on, and uh, this, this tractor is a little bit underpowered. I can only get it up to about mm, 18... 19 maybe 20 miles per hour uh, but with a more powerful tractor all you need is a front uh, three-point link and of course the worker as I just hired a worker the worker will operate it as well so there you go so um, the thing with the Laco Tech um, <clears throat> you can attach any of those forage harvester headers on the front of this unit and it will work just like uh, the forage harvester. However, you can use your own tractor. You don't have to buy the, you know, the really expensive forage harvesters anymore. Um, and okay, so let's go back here. Let's buy a tractor for a second because I just want to show you that the the one issue 
with the modded Lacotec. And if uh, Mr. Didi Modge Passion is watching, um, I'm not sure what kind of fix there is for this. So as you can see, I picked it up. It's in the up position. The pipe is out. Pipe out. But I don't have any way of lowering it. There is no option to lower it. Unload, change driving directions, honk, turn on the harvester. It'll say no, no header is attached. Uh, cruise control, un unlock, cruise. So <clears throat> unlike the, the base game one, I'm not sure what has happened. I can't. I can't lower this unit. Uh, there is no option. And if I hook up, if I hook up an attachment to it, I can raise and lower the attachment, the header. So now I have the adjustment, but as you can see, even if I have that highlighted, it's just the, the, the only thing that moves is the attachment. And uh, although, that might not be a problem. You'd still be able to use it. However, it makes it a little bit more tricky and difficult to use. Um, it will actually still work with the tool height control um, because uh, even in a fully raised position, the tool height control harvester headers will work. It's just a little bit awkward um, and the base game one will work too so there the only thing is this one I was hoping we could use this one with a regular um, tool high, a non tool height control header because there's a there's a couple of modded you could use the modded ones on there but it's not gonna work uh, because you can't raise and lower this so that's the caveat I guess Yes, the little bit of a downside. However, it's a very minor detail compared to the, all the awesomeness that we have got. Um, right, so I think that's about it. Uh, it's quite quite a significant package. Um, I, there's might have been something I missed. I hope not. Um, I could have spent oh oodles and oodles another hour or so. <laughs> testing out each and every one of them however i think that's a good overall view of what's available and what you can do with it there's many other things you can uh, experiment with um and mix and match and so forth but that's the basic uh, gist of it this and so that is the update to the tool height control for headers significant another game changing update mod from dd mod passion 0.2 megabytes to download I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. So till next time, bye for now.